Hey y'all, it's me, your girl Shonda, and I'm back, y'all, doing another vlog. I told y'all I was coming back. Today is Thursday, December the 7th of 2023, y'all. It's almost Friday. Today is Friday Junior. Friday Junior, y'all. Thursday. Okay, so y'all, what I'm doing is I decided to do a little short vlog not too long just spending the day with me today um right now i am about to leave because i got some things to do and before i leave i just rinsed off my roast y'all i got a beef chuck roast and i'm about to uh, season it up and put it over there in my crock pot <clears throat> throw my seasonings in there my um onions i gotta pick up a bag of potatoes and um carrots while I'm out, because that's going in my roast dish. So, yeah, y'all, I'm not really doing a whole, whole lot. I just wanted to pop on and say hey. And this looks like it might turn into a little mini cooking vlog of me showing y'all how I do my roast. So, let me go get my uh, water and then I'm gonna come back to y'all. Okay, y'all, I'm back. So I went ahead and put some water in my crock pot. I already have it on. It was already preheating. So what I put in my roast, and I got my glove on because I don't feel like keep washing my hands like that. I put in beef bouillon cubes. It's a brand new jar. So anyway, beef bouillon, garlic powder, Montreal steak seasoning, parsley, onion powder a lot of onion powder onion powder is a natural tenderizer so when you see me douse this roast with onion powder just know that it is going to be a nice juicy tender roast because of this mrs dash the uh garlic and herb blend black pepper and um cilantro a little bit and then I use my, um, what is this? The smoked paprika and onion seasoning that I have been loving so much. And this is the cracked pepper and garlic seasoning. Y'all see, I've been really, really using these. I really love these two. These are my two new staples to my kitchen seasoning cabinet. So let me go ahead and season my, my um, I'm gonna put my roast in the water and then I'm gonna just go ahead and pour my seasonings in the water, okay? So I'll be back, y'all. Y'all, this is my secret ingredient. I put a whole stick of butter in my roast. So this is how I do it. Open the stick up and I just cut it into little sections. Cut the butter up. Like so. See? And I just drop them in different air, different spots. Just drop it in. That's it. Cover and let it cook. Oh, and since I did not have 
any celery flakes. I sprinkle, sprinkled a little bit of these celery seeds in my roast. Hey y'all, I'm out the door. It's such a beautiful day outside. Can y'all see the sun up there? Yes, it's so pretty. It's so beautiful out the door. Um, I just had somebody uh, ask, uh, tell me that I was, first of all, they said I was cute. Then they said they like my hair. And then they said, your lips is popping. What is on your lips? I'm like, I sell lip gloss. <laughs> I have my own brand, Slips Gloss by Shonda. And I told them where they can find it. So there we go, y'all. If can't nobody advertise or market your products, you can, okay? Don't be relying and depending on nobody else to do it for you. Y'all see my lips? That girl lips is popping, popping. Okay? <laughs> so yeah, if y'all haven't shopped with me, go check me out. Now, I was gonna try to just like specialize in lip tints because I'm very, very, very popular when it comes to lip tints. Like, my formula is the best in the world. I promise you that. And then second, um, my gloss is the best formula in the world. Okay? I promise you that. So, yeah. Go check me out. I have, right now, the only gloss that I have in my shop. I'm, I'm about to add a couple more. And I'm bringing out a new product, too. Y'all gonna love it. Um is the plumper gloss and what other gloss that i have hmm i'm not sure i don't know i don't know i have to look but y'all go check it out on the etsy um uh, my link is always in the description so just check out there and uh, make sure you check it out my clicking on my link tree link too okay because there are things in there that you don't want to miss and you may want to um check out okay so i'm getting ready to go I'm about to put on my seatbelt and drive safely to my destination. And I'll come back to y'all shortly, okay? I hope y'all having a blessed day. If you live in my state, get out and enjoy the weather. I don't know where you live, but it seems like we're having really nice weather now. It's really sunny. It's becoming a little bit more mild. Um, I let Diamond out, so she's going to stay out while I'm gone because it's nice enough for her to stay out. And she'll enjoy that, too, because she likes to sunbathe since the sun is shining real bright today. Okay, y'all? So, deuces. I'm Audi, 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 Audi. Audi Fat Thousand, baby. <laughs> so, y'all, I'm blushing. Because I love when people are nice to me. Now, I'm out and about, right? And this, I just look how I feel. Before I went into one of the stores, I just left. It was a lady, older white lady. She was coming out the store and she was walking like she wasn't even paying attention. She was looking down and she looked up and she stopped and she was like, Oh my God, you are so cute. I said, Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. She said, Yeah, you're welcome. Have a good day. And I said, You have a good day too. Thank you. So then I get in the store immediately greeted by everybody it's like everybody is waking up Every, it's like i'm walking in places and people are waking up and y'all this is not the first time this has happened this happens very often like it's happened a lot in my life um yeah like god is so good god is so good like it doesn't matter what you're going through you know just remain calm be grateful and be mindful that god is in control you know you don't have to look like what you feel like you know what i'm saying and i definitely don't look like what i feel like okay trust me i don't um the total opposite i feel the total opposite of what i look like today y'all and i think i do look cute like i got my pink on i'm rocking my pink Somebody called me a strawberry shortcake yesterday because I had on, um, today I got my pink wig on. Yesterday I had my red wig on with uh, my pink coat and I had some red clothes and something else pink. And this lady told me I look so cute. I look like a little strawberry shortcake. <laughs> and I love it and I see, I see the vision. I see the red and the pink. Yeah, I can see strawberry shortcake. I like it. 
So just to say that even guys are stopping to say, hey, and um, yeah, just, you know what I'm saying? Hey, you look good. And I'm like, thank you. You know, nobody's being disrespectful. Nobody's being mean. And I just thank God. I really do, y'all. It's nobody but God that has brought me this far and that keeps me smiling. Um, I'm glad I'm able to maintain this smile and, you know, keeping my appearance up. When you look good, you feel good. Like, I feel great. Um, I'm hungry, but other than that, I do feel great. And I'm just, I'm blushing because people like me. <laughs> oh, like I said, this ain't nothing new nothing new this happens to me all the time oh, you hear me when i say all the time i mean all the time by different people from different walks of life different races just all kinds of people ages like everybody you know and like i said it's nothing but god this is all god y'all this is all god and i just thank him okay so today i want y'all to look y'all's best Feel y'all's best, okay? And walk in, walk with purpose. Walk with purpose, okay? Let that be the lesson for today. Walking with purpose. When you look good, you feel good. And show gratitude, all right? Yeah. Oh my goodness. This is all I went in there to get. Y'all see this? I went in Walmart. One bag. And it took me forever because everybody kept stopping me. I like your hair. I like your lashes. I like your coat. I like your lips. I like your purse. I like your shirt. I like your shoes. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, God. Oh, but God. But God. <laughs> So, and I'm not bragging. I'm not bragging. I'm just saying, I look good. Mm. Stage three breast cancer, where? Where? Hmm? Where? Where? That's all I'm saying. Where? Hmm? Stage three, where? <laughs> Y'all, I'm so silly. So I'm done shopping. I finally, no, I gotta stop one more store. Okay, anyway, I gotta, um, somebody looking at me. I'm about to go get me something to eat real quick. Cause I still gotta stop at the store. Cause that roast is not gonna be done until um, later. Probably tomorrow, I don't know. But anyway, all right, y'all. Hey y'all, I'm back, y'all. I have been sitting here working on my um, my color party decorations for my basket, and I want to show y'all how far I, that I've gotten. Okay, it's a work in progress, but trust the process. Hold on. Okay. Y'all, this is what I have done so far. This was an all-white basket. As you can see, the handle is white. But I'm I'm currently working on this one, this handle, to change it. To put that on there so it can look like this. Yeah, your girl got skills. And I'll decorate it with the lace going all the way around. All the way around. It's sparkly, it's yellow, and I gotta fill in the inside. There's nothing in there. So, okay, y'all, this is the bottom half where everything will sit inside of, okay? And I got some crinkle paper too. I'm gonna fill that. This is the rest of my fabric roll that I use to put on here. And I got me some of these little pom poms, yellow pom poms. I got some more of the garland. I got another roll of it. But I got plenty left over, see. Okay, and then this part here, this is another basket. Same as this one. All I did was I cut a hole in it and I removed the uh, handles. 
as you can see the handles are non-existent so my whole point for doing that was because i want to make this basket into like a christmas tree okay so that's how it's going to be decorated this is the bottle and the handles are going to be decorated i'm going to have my um i got me some uh, lights to put on my tree and this part will be removable because i'm going to have all my items inside the, the basket but i just want it to be like a little looks like a christmas tree so yeah that's what i'm doing y'all that's gonna sit on top i gotta finish decorating this uh kind of similar to how i did this yeah okay y'all get it all right okay so that's that y'all i got so much stuff to do i gotta dye my pajamas i gotta bedazzle my cup did i show y'all my cup <laughs> This is my cup. <laughs> so, I think it's the Paw Patrol, y'all. I'm going to bedazzle this cup. This is my cup, okay? It's yellow. And I'm going to bedazzle it with yellow uh, jewels and glitter. And y'all going to see it's going to be really pretty. Trust the process, okay? So, I got a, quite a few things to do. I've been really busy today. I found me a cute... Um, headband with the yellow little pom-poms on the back of it is purple though but all that matters is this can i can i put this on real quick can i can i get it on there we go <laughs> y'all i am funny and y'all have y'all seen or heard of these i found these two they're called twinkie flavored candy canes Twinkie flavored candy canes. They're yellow, so they fit my theme. Okay, and you can't have yellow items without having this. Y'all, I got me a lemon. Lemon juice. So I think I might be adding some of this lemon juice in um one of my drinks with one of those wines to like sweeten it up. Cause I don't think two of them, I don't believe they're gonna be sweet. So this is going to give it a little uh, sweet because I like sweet wine. I don't like dry, bland tasting wines. I like sweet and I definitely, definitely prefer sweet red wines. But it's okay. It's a, My color is yellow, so I'm going to work with it. So, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and finish all of this stuff. I want to try to finish most of my... Well, I want to try to finish my basket tonight and then work on my cup tomorrow. And then this weekend, I want to work on dyeing my uh, pajamas because I got to decorate them too, y'all. I got to decorate them. So I got work to do. I'm about to be pretty busy here. Your girl about to be busy. And yeah, because I got a contest to win, okay? I'm going to let y'all know when I come back that I won a contest. I know I'm going to win. I, already, I just know I'm going to win. I already know it, okay? So... I'm about to get out here, y'all. I don't want to draw this vlog out any more longer than what we have already done, okay? So, guess what? Y'all, and my chest is really sore. Like, I'm having some really bad pains here in my chest bone here. It's been through so much. I've had the, um, when I had my brain surgery, that tube is going down the center of my chest, and it is so sore. They had to go in there digging and pulling and pushing. And and then I just had breast surgery. So my little bones up here in my chest are so sore. You hear me? I went to press on it a little bit. And I said, uh-uh, oh, Jesus. Jesus, what is inside of my bones that's making them hurt that bad? But anyway, that's neither here nor there. Because, ooh, but God. But God, y'all, okay? So, guess what? Y'all know how we do when it's time to go? Y'all know how we do when it's time to go? Hey, when it's time to go? Y'all know how we do when it's time to go? Hey, <laughs> I'm going to have to make up a dance for that. Stay safe. 
stay healthy, and stay blessed. Deuces. I love y'all so, 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 so much. Until next time. I love y'all. <laughs>